A 45 year old man from Alma has been arrested in connection to the death. Right now, he's facing a charge of aggravated assault, but not murder. And investigators say he's not making any statements. And they say tonight, they're still trying to figure out exactly what happened. And it is strange that right now we have one person who is deceased. We have somebody else in jail and many people are going to wonder where's the proper charge. But we have to remember there's a process that this has to go through. William Moon is being held in jail on a $100,000 cash only bond in connection to the death of 42 year old Robert Hinton from Fayetteville. Captain Philip Peavy House says Sebastian County deputies were called to a disturbance at this house on Bean Ridge Road just outside of Greenwood Tuesday night. When they arrived, they found Moon in the driveway bloody and it looked like he'd been in a fight. Near the back of the house, they found Hinton face down and unresponsive. Captain Peavy House says it appeared he'd also been in a fight. They did everything they could. Um, CPR, uh, we also, uh, not every patrol unit, but most of them have an AED device that was retrieved. They tried to get his heart started again. Uh, as they're doing these things to do what they can, EMS arrived within moments. EMS took over and uh, it wasn't long after that they realized all their efforts were unsuccessful. PV House says the two men knew each other and that both had permission to be at the house and they were the only ones there. It's my understanding that Mr. Hinton was a son of the residence owner. Jail records describe the aggravated assault charge as being on a family or household member and then says choke. We asked about it. Well, it could very well be, but that matter's still under investigation. And so we want to always make sure we're right and not just say something to be saying something for the camera, but, but to give the public the best information as we have. Captain PV House says tonight they're not looking for any other people they think are connected to the death. He hopes to have preliminary results back from the medical examiner's office in the next few days. And Moon is scheduled to appear in court one week from today. In Fort Smith, Brett Rains, 4029 News.